Hello and welcome back to my channel. We're at Butlins in Bognor Regis on a Just for Tots week and we're going to take you on a tour around the resort showing you some of the features and entertainments that are available here. There are two entrances at Butlins, one for staying guests and one for day visitors and those staying at the Wave Hotel. This is the main entrance. They have a wide range of accommodation from budget rooms to luxury lodges. This is the Ocean Hotel. This is the Wave Hotel. This is the Shoreline Hotel. Oyster Bay has a variety of value rooms and apartments. Atlantic and Seaside Bay are where you'll find the Gold and Seaside Apartments. If you've purchased a meal plan, you'll be eating in one or two of these restaurants. This is the brand new splash pool which opened last year. They have a number of different slides, rapids and pools that are brilliant fun for all the family. The fairground rides are included in the price of your ticket. The traditional fairground is open daily, although times will vary depending on the season or if they have a special event like Halloween. The Skyline Pavilion houses rides and shows, restaurants and bars and arcades and shops. The pavilion is pretty much the centre of the resort. The Skyline stage has a range of shows including the Skyline Gang. The pavilion is all under cover, so no matter if it rains or shines, there's plenty to do. They've got lots of different arcade machines to keep you amused, and hot shots in case you fancy a game of bowling, which cost extra. Plenty of Butlins merch and gifts to buy in the Butlins store. Here he is, 
traditional seaside entertainment in the castle courtyard where you can watch a puppet show. The indoor fairground hours vary depending on the season or special events. The indoor soft play area is currently closed due to the pandemic. There's a Burger King if you fancy a bite to eat. I think it's surprising just how big the pavilion is. The centre stage is one of the main venues for live acts and entertainment. It's laid out a little differently at the moment because of social distancing. Reds is another venue showing live entertainment and silent cinema. Just outside the pavilion you'll find a parade of shops and restaurants and the supermarket. The supermarket is well stocked with lots of essentials you may need during your stay. Why not treat your little one to a fairy makeover? The leisure hub is where you can book your outside activities like go-karts and the climbing wall. Then there's guest services and the first aid centre. They have a laundrette. The hire shop is just outside the pavilion and you can hire fun bikes and carts or room essentials like high chairs and cots. Why not treat yourself to an ice cream or a sundae at Scoop? The tables are fun for little ones. The beach coma serves a range of pub style food. You can enjoy a game of island themed crazy golf, which is currently six pounds a person.
For an extra charge, you can try the outdoor activities like aerial adventures, the football academy, go-karting, which is currently £6 a cart, or dune buggies, which are currently £2 a buggy. Take your picture on a giant deck chair for your social media. They have a number of play areas to keep little ones amused while you recharge with a cup of coffee or just have a little rest. Butlins is right next to the beach. Head to the Day Visitors Gate next to Atlantic Bay and you're a minute's walk away from the sand, stones and sea. And when it's time to drag yourself away from all the fun and go home, you can pop your key into one of the boxes. I hope you enjoyed this video and you found it useful. If you did, then please give it a like. If you want to see more from me in the future, then click the subscribe button right here. And if you want to see more from me right now, then click on one of these videos. And we'll see you again soon. Bye.